John, do you have any memories of Sidney Newman? Did yes, he? I, I do. Sidney um, stalked all our toilets for many a long year. He was Canadian, wasn't he, Dennis? He believed, Jesus Christ, man, uh, that everybody ought to everybody else, and out of the resultants come, would come creation. So he was very happy if he heard that two producers had actually in the men's toilet on the third floor. Because <laughs> to, to Sydney, this was how life should be. Um, Hitler worked on the same print. <laughs> you know what happened to him. And um, <laughs> well, we know what happened to him. All the heads of the departments then could each other, and the producers then could want to get into other departments, but you weren't allowed to please yourself. And story editors couldn't change, and you were chained to your desks and ideas, even though his name may not be remembered now, because he's been gone a long time. Not dead, I mean disappeared. Uh, gone back to Canada, same thing. Um, <laughs> no, I mean, uh, I don't think they've ever quite recovered from the fact that he came up, Jesus Christ, and blew the head of my department, who was Donald Wilson, who was head of serials. And good luck to him. Yes, that's the Sydney. Mm.